Sir Jack today, who is the president at Wapit Sports. Um, Robert has had over 24 years of experience in the leisure industry. And as you can see today, he joins us from his wonderful office in Germany in his lovely swimming pool. Thank you so much, Robert, for spending this time with us today. Nice to meet you. So tell us a little more about the story behind the Webit brand. Well, imagine the scene. Two people meet on a soccer field and we end up changing the way the world plays on water. So my, my partner, a German fellow, we met playing football soccer and we had a love of sports so we created and had the inspiration for taking a playground through the water it's something we actually call amphibianization so you have amphibian vehicles or animals that actually both live in the land or can work in the water so basically we just had the idea and it's expanded ever since that now that, that's a wonderful idea and, and look where we bit is today. That's fantastic. Um, I'm sure you've had many proud moments in, in your career since you've established we bit. If you could share one with us, that's very close to your heart. Well, wow, that's, a, that's a big list. Well, let me maybe give you a, a, a moment that really changed everything for us. You know, my, my partner and I were in Las Vegas exhibiting at a trade show. And we go into the elevator, and at the last second, a 70, 75-year-old woman walks into the elevator. And as we're going up to our floor, she turns around and looks at us and says, hey, you guys are the women guys. You make those fun products on the water. So I, I smiled to my, my partner and I said to him, looks like we got a brand. So... So that was kind of a moment where we looked at each other and said, hey, things are really going into the right direction. That's amazing. When, when someone you don't know recognizes you, your products, your brand, it's a wonderful feeling, isn't it? Um, so, so tell us one thing that you believe will change this industry's future. Yeah, I think that, you know, there's not going to be a pre-corona time. I think we're forever changed. And I think that most of the locations, the entertainment locations, you know, they're going to probably provide space to the consumer. The consumer will want space. I mean, skipping the line was very popular before, but I think there's going to be a huge amount of the population that's going to be willing to pay for extra space. And that could involve, like I said, you know, an extra access to the, to the roller coaster or to the ride or an extra waiting area. So I think there's going to be a two-tier system. You know, it's almost like when you walk into an airplane, there's a reason why they make you walk through the business class area. They want you to see them. So I think there's going to be a kind of business class opportunities within these theme parks. It's something actually that I, that I don't like. I believe it should be for everybody, but I think there's gonna be a real demand to be able to provide this service for these VIP guests who are willing to pay more. Sure, that, 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 that's, that's very interesting. Um, so Robert, did you have a mentor? Tell us more about this. Yeah, I mean, like I said before, we, we love sports and, and I grew up playing football myself. And so I would say one of my, my mentors was my, my soccer coach. And it's just something I believe is, you know, coaching and having a good coach at a young age, I think that is so important throughout your lifetime. And, you know, my coach came up to me and, you know, he knew I was a pretty decent player, but he said something to me that I remembered. And it was kind of like, you know, Robert, it's not about how good you are. It's about how good do you want to be? And there's a big difference between that. And we've just had a passion to be the best at what we do. And we love this. You know, we can't imagine doing anything else. Well, it certainly looks like you and, and everybody in your team enjoys it. I mean, I mean, look at you guys in a pool, in the office. 
Go ahead and be assignment too, but it's amazing. <laughs> well, well, thank you so much, Robert, for spending this time with us. It was an absolute pleasure. Uh, we wish you and Weaver Sports all the very best for your from Saudi and State. Perfect. And next time, feel free to join me. <laughs> for sure, will do. Thank you very much. See you later. Okay. You're welcome. Bye-bye.